2015, Camp Hope America, Oregon, was was founded. The partnership between a Safe Place Family Justice Center and Clackamas Women's Services in Oregon City. Generally speaking, it's a few week long um, summer camp and and then year long mentoring program afterwards. Um, that supports youth who have witnessed or experienced family violence. There's a pretty big age range from six to 17, um, and we engage in a lot of different activities. The Camp Hope team, the adults that support all of our campers, have a 40 hour training for domestic violence advocacy and Camp Hope you know, training, so it's great. There's a lot of positive role models in there to build those connections, to build those safe adults that at all of our all of our campers can feel comfortable sharing, you know, experiences with, but just opening up and being vulnerable with. I know with with camp counselors, we talk about like taking off your cool jacket and or ripping up your cool card, right? Um, but also creating like a supportive environment where the, we are giving them permission to be to be silly, to be goofy, to be playful and know that we're going to support them and that we're not going to say, oh, that looks weak. You know, like we're not going to be judgmental of them. It's like we will give them permission and and that, you know, translates to at camp and then hopefully, I mean, beyond, you know that it has for me. And we talk about hope heroes. These are people, um, sometimes they're more public figures, sometimes they're, they're less public figures that have maybe experienced similar things to some of our campers. and. We're able to read about them, to learn from them, and have a structured discussion about them to create that pathway to hope, right? To have role models that, that campers can look at and say, you know, they did that, maybe I can too. We always talk about where we saw hope for that day. And we ask everybody um, to share, and it might be a small thing, it might be a very big thing, but we really want to map out that intentional time about learning and hearing where folks saw hope. We find that that also you know, helps people practice looking for hope and finding hope in their lives and their day-to-day -day lives. It's also about cheering for them and making sure that they feel recognized and supported in whatever they attempt to do. I'll invite you to think back to when you were a young person, a teen or in your childhood. And not all of us, you know, had a, a camp experience or summer camp of some kind, but perhaps you could think back to when you had an experience in nature as a young person, when that time in the natural world maybe felt healing or relaxing or nourishing for you, and maybe just seeing in your mind and your the power of your imagination what that looked like, sounded like, smelled like for you. If that's not something that feels accessible or a memory for you, um, maybe reaching out a little further and thinking back in your childhood or, or young adulthood when you had someone that was encouraging you or cheering you on. Maybe there was just even one time when there was something challenging or new and you had the space to be brave or to um, have the support to experience choosing courage. Um, in an experience. Some of what I was describing um, is some of the power and impact for, I think, what our youth get to experience at Camp Hope. <laughs>